to our continued Advent video series. My name is Father Jim Kiter, pastor of our Catholic family of parishes. And I'm here today with one of our young adults who I will have her introduce herself. Uh, hi, I'm Jordan Arms. I go to Crofton High School. I'm a junior. I'm fourth out of 11 kids and my parents are Jason and Jane Arms. Awesome. Uh, probably a cool thing being from a big family, isn't it? Yeah, I guess. Always, always lots of new things, I'm sure, happening. Mm -hmm. um, this week, um, in the fourth week of Advent, our focus has been on invitation. How God continually invites us to grow deeper in our faith, uh, to fall more in love with Him. Could you maybe share how you've experienced invitation from God our Father uh, and have grown in your faith? Um, I guess we, uh, my family's always been very active in sports and like different activities and uh, we do a lot of running <laughs> and so I kind of use running as my way of like especially during a tough run like reflecting and like giving a quick prayer because I'm struggling and I know that each of the stages struggles with God and I guess especially like after the races and stuff I know that um, since I was struggling that others must be struggling too so I find it very important to just go back and like congratulate them and help them especially when they may be at their lowest point. Yeah I, I love that example because the greatest commandment love God with all of your heart mind soul and strength and obviously the, the strength of the endurance of, of running um, and, you're, and you're loving God through that. But then you said how in recognizing your own struggles, others probably are experiencing similar struggles, and you go back and support them right away, um, which is just a, a really cool uh, example of, of you encountering God's love, but then letting that you know be passed on to others as well. Thank you for sharing. Um, maybe continuing on, uh, since you've been blessed with this ability and gift to run and you've experienced success in your high school career uh, so far, um, maybe share how you see that blessing and that ability uh, to run as a, a gift that God has invited you to, to use to give Him honor and glory. Could you maybe share how your faith and that blessing to run uh, go hand in hand? Um, I guess it's always been kind of like, uh, I mean, my parents always taught us to like expect others and like put our best foot forward, especially since like, I know like when we were younger and in St. Rose, we were always taught that um, like with your talents and that you have to like show like your talents, otherwise, don't bury them. So I guess by me doing my best and like trying to help others like succeed and stuff that I'm able to like use that to like better others and myself. Yeah, that's awesome. Thank you. Um, maybe one last question. Going back to the, the idea of invitation. Um, how do you see the, the Lord, you know, as a, as a daughter, as a sister, as a student, as an athlete? How do you see God using all those different aspects of your life? How do you see God inviting you uh, to grow closer to him um, and to help others grow closer to him? I've been able to do like a lot of cool things through sports and like gone a lot of cool places and been able to meet a lot of different people and I guess that that's a way that God's like invited me to like reach out to other people and show kindness to them and I guess like for school wise always like do my best and study and, and yeah <laughs> so. yeah and I'm sure you have to help out with the family at times and uh, watch the younger brothers and sisters and take care of them. So, well, thank you for your time. And thank you for sharing a little bit of your story today with us. 
We wish all of you a very blessed Advent and a Merry Christmas.